Welcome or welcome back to my little creative corner of the internet. Today it's time for another studio vlog. Over the last few weeks my Etsy shop kind of blew up with orders and kept me quite busy. One of my items even got the bestseller badge. Today I wanted to take you on the wild ride with me that was my small business the last month and tell the story of how I created my first bestseller. It all started a month ago when I had 30 sold articles. The Christmas themed the Christmas themed stickers were going really slow and I didn't really expect anything. I just thought maybe a few orders would come in over time like the month before. But then a few orders for my 2022 calendar stickers came in. And I suddenly had six orders at a time, which was so much for me. I was really amazed and so happy that people really seemed to like my illustrated 2022 calendar stickers. I did offer Christmas wrapping over the months of December and had so much fun putting a lot of love in every single order. Wrapping it, writing a little personal note and adding some little freebie stickers. Then another batch of five orders came in and I sold three of my hand-bound sketchbook. This meant the absolute world to me. Every order that comes into my shop makes me so absolutely happy. And I thank every single one of you who has supported me over the last few months by buying from the shop, watching my videos or liking and following me on social media. Thank you so, so much. At this time I was so amazed by the amazing response I got, but I had absolutely no idea what would come next. On December 21st, I hit 100 sold articles in the shop and I was quite amazed by tripling my sold articles in under a month. But it wouldn't stop there. As my shop was picking up some traction, I did get a few more orders for other stickers and my ephemera packs and printables as well. But nothing would keep up with the rapid speed at which my illustrated 2022 calendar stickers were selling. They would go out of stock twice a day and I did quite a few late nights cutting stickers and packing orders. Thanks so much again. It means the absolute world to me to know that I now have planner buddies all over the world who match with me with my little illustrations on their 2022 calendars. I hope the calendar stickers bring you all a lot of joy throughout the year. 
The stickers were something I originally just created for myself because after five years of bullet journaling it gets quite annoying to have to write out the little calendars all the time, especially in the beginning of the year. And I thought maybe someone would be as annoyed by this as me and has the same problem and likes my art style. Why not put them in my Etsy shop? But at that point I thought everyone is doing calendar stickers for the beginning of the new year in the planner community, so my little shop would not stand a chance. But I liked the design I created, so I put them out there anyway. But I would have never dreamed of the response they would get. Here you can see me create my artist resolution for 2022 post for Instagram. My creative resolutions for the new year are to make more YouTube videos, make some new products for the shop, spend more time in my sketchbook and to just have fun with my art and relax. I want to remind me to also create just for myself from time to time without having to make the next masterpiece video or product. At this point, I thought the calendar storm was done, as the new year was right around the corner. But I would be mistaken. It was just about to begin. The calendar sticker orders kept on rolling in. They kept on coming. My shop kept on growing. And I was amazed and so, so happy about all the love they received. And then my 2022 calendar stickers got the bestseller badge from Etsy and the orders kept on coming.
One day I typed in 2022 calendar stickers in a private browser and realized that my stickers weren't only on the first page of the search results like I maybe hoped for. They were the first article shown in the search result. That wasn't a paid ad. And that's the story of how I created my first bestseller product by offering a solution to a problem I had myself. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, a thumbs up would make me really happy. And if you want to join me on my creative journey, hit the subscribe button down below.